Let's do a little bit more with limits and graphs because it's fun. Using the graph, find the value of each of the following limits. Okay, so let's start here. When x approaches negative 3 from the left, x approaching negative 3 from the left, so my graph is going up, positive infinity. As x approaches negative 5, okay, x approaches negative 5, so right there, doesn't matter which direction I'm coming from, my y values are approaching 4. As x approaches negative 1, x approaches negative 1, my graph is doing this right there. y is also negative 1. The limit as x approaches negative 3. x approaches negative 3, oh, oh, that part of the graph goes that way, that one goes that way. Now, it doesn't exist, why? The limit as x approaches negative 3 from the left does not equal the limit as x approaches negative 3 from the right. x approaches 2 from the left. So here's when x is 2. The graph is going right there. So from the left side only. It's approaching 1. As x approaches 2 from the right. So from the right side, it's up here. Which is 6. As x approaches 2 uh-oh. Overall, does not exist because the limit as x approaches 2 from the left does not equal the limit as x approaches 2 from the right. Oops. Bad notation. Be careful with your notation. As x approaches negative infinity, and then this one says x approaches positive. So x approaching negative infinity is going this way. So it's the graph doing. The graph is kind of leveling off at a horizontal asymptote, which is at 2. The limit as x approaches positive infinity. So going that way. The graph is going, oh, up, 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 up. It's going to keep going. Take another one. The limit as x approaches negative 3 from the left. Here's when x is negative 3. So from the left side, it's approaching that hole, which is 0. When x approaches negative 6, that's right there, that point, negative 4 x approaches negative 1 from the right. Oh, that's a 2. x approaches negative 3 from the right. Oh, it still approaches 0. x approaches positive 4 from the left. Pull this down. So approaching positive 4 from the left side. As x approaches positive 4 from the left side, that one's kind of interesting because there isn't part of the graph that's approaching positive 4 from the left side. Graph stops at 3. There is nothing there. So that does not exist. The graph does not exist as x 
approaches four from the left. There's nothing there. Now, what about from the right? From the right, we do have a graph approaching it. It's going down, 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 down to negative infinity. So what would we say overall about as x approaches 4? Well, first off, they don't match. Easy. Does not exist because the limit as x approaches 4 from the left does not equal the limit as x approaches 4 from the right. Now, what about the limit as x approaches negative 4 from the right? Go back up here. Negative 4 from the right side. We are approaching this point right here, which I would say is about negative 2.5. And as we approach the same x value from the left side of the graph, that's actually down here which would be at negative 6.